Hi guys, welcome back. It's uh, day seven, the last meal of our seven day challenge. I hope you guys have enjoyed the videos. I've had great fun doing them. So tonight is going to be one of our family favorites, South African dish called babuti. It's basically beef mince with uh, you can use any any type of curry powder, but I'm using a Roger South African curry powder. We've got three apples, half a cup of raisins, some peppers, and two onions. So I'm going to get that all in on the go, and then I'll explain the process as we go. So to start off with, we'll get the onions all sauteed up. Right, so now we've got the onions nicely browned. I'm just going to throw one teaspoon of garlic, crushed garlic. What we're going to do is we're going to put one tablespoon of curry powder into the onions. Right, next we're going to put the peppers in. Right, so now we've got those all nicely browned off. What we want to do is, I've got a kilo of mince here, beef mince. Now we're just going to add that to it. And we're going to brown the meat off. Right, so we've, the mince has now been browned off. It's taken about five, six minutes. What we want to do now is, is just 400 mils of stock, one more tablespoon of curry powder now. And now we're going to let that simmer away there for about 15 minutes. It's now been about 10 minutes and what we're going to do now is we're just going to add in the raisins and the apple. Right, so this has been about half an hour now. It's looking really good. And the one thing we've got to do now is we just take one piece of bread, soak it in the milk. And now what we do is we just take that milk, squeeze some of the bread out, and just break it up into the... The last thing we're doing is taking four eggs. What you want to do is just whisk that up. And then we just pour the egg on top. We turn that down to low and we leave that for about 10 minutes. Right guys, we now have the finished product. So that's the uh, egg that's gone nicely laid on the top. Looks absolutely delicious. So guys, tomorrow what I'm going to do, I'm going to post one more video, basically giving you an overview of all the barbecues that we've cooked on. And then if you are interested, I'll get to provide you more or less which one would suit your needs. 